Hi loves, welcome to At Home with Efe. I'm your host Efe and I am so glad that you took the time to just tune in and check out my video here on the YouTube world. So today I'm decorating our front porch for fall. As you can see, we have a couple of pumpkins here and there, some rugs and a bunch of mums. So if you are interested to see how I obtain this look, please stay tuned. Hey guys, thanks for sticking around. So this is what our porch looked like at the end of spring, beginning of summer with the pop of color with the little um, flowers there. I think they're called impatience. So, um, so now I'm going to tackle first the wreath on the door and I'm switching it with this fall wreath that I got from a local store here called Real Canadian Superstore. A little bit of background. My husband and I are originally from the Ivory Coast, which is also known as Cote d'Ivoire. My first language is French. And uh, 20 years ago, we moved to the US. And uh, two years ago, we actually relocated to Canada. So we lived in the Windsor area. So those happy fall banners are from Amazon.com. I decided to go with them to cover up the window area. Those are frosted glass so we can't really see from the inside out. And I decided just to cover it up and it's, it makes a big statement piece, uh, a welcoming at the entrance there for our guests. And both of them have the same size. Unfortunately, the way they built the house, this side was way bigger uh, somebody did not do their job right so I had to figure it out how to hang this side of the banner so here's my nephew Mark helping we use a command strip to kind of like uh, stick it there and it was able to hold for a while then after that we had to do push pins but hey nobody noticed the way we did it it was it was fine it worked out and um, if you don't mind them flying around when it's very very windy I recommend it it's an easy um, hassle-free decor item that you can put if you have this type of door next up is this chair I'm just going to change the pillowcase I found this hello fall pillowcase on amazon.com again so because the pillowcase is now waterproof i'm gonna use scotch guard and spray the pillow is waterproof but the pillowcase is not so i still wanted to protect it so as because it's outside and it's exposed to the elements i didn't want it to be moldy or anything like that so i sprayed scotch guard and it, it does wonders so i highly recommend it it works it is not a commercial it, re it truly works the next thing that I do, I'm gonna change the doormat from the home sweet home to another fall like doormat. So I just sweep the floor because it was a little bit dirty there and I cleaned it up. Um, previously though, before I decorated everything, I just wanna give you a heads up that I clean, I you know, sweep the floors, I wipe the door, um, everything that was supposed to be done i did it but i didn't want to burden you with me watching me clean everything so i just skip to the part that you are interested in okay but i use windex for the windows and did all that and remove the cobweb and everything else i got this fall doormat from michael stores here locally and I decided to go with a layering look so I kept the buffalo plaid at the bottom and then I added the doormat on top for a layering effect 
one way to keep your pumpkins from rotting especially since we've had such warm um, temperatures is to actually soak them in uh, so you wash them with soap and water and then you soak them for an hour in a bleach and water solution so i'm gonna add some more pumpkins but this is what i wanted to do right now so i could get this video to you guys for your enjoyment but i'm gonna add some orange and some green pumpkins So if you like what you saw, don't forget to like and subscribe and also hit the notification bell so you can stay up to date when I post new material, new videos. If you love all things fall decor, I have a few other videos that I was able to produce so you can check them out also for your enjoyment and for some inspiration. And if you are into Tablescape, I have a few videos also that will give you a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to design some Tablescape to wow your guests. If it's your cup of tea, I would like for you to again subscribe and like. And I hope to see you again on my channel. Love you guys. Bye y'all.